All right, guys. Welcome to the first um, complete, you can see everything, video uh, on Lifting the Veil. That is my channel, Lifting the Veil. Uh, if you have yet to subscribe, please subscribe. Uh, lifting the Veil, opening your eyes. That is what I was told to do. What I, that I, that I, that's why I was sent here to open the eyes of the blind. Um, so first off, I would like to point out that right here in Colossians, Second Colossians, or Second Corinthians, um, the in two eleven, Second Corinthians two eleven. At least Satan should get an advantage of us. Advantage. Meaning you lack something that he does not lack. Knowledge. Uh, wise as a serpent, gentle as a lamb. Um, anyways, that's just a side note as for the advantage breaking down. Anyways, for we are not ignorant of his devices. Alright, so right there. So we are not ignorant of his devices. Most of us are. Uh, most of us are. Um, and I'm going to prove that right now as well. And then we're going to point out what his one of his best devices is. Is this it? Yeah. No. Holly, where is that? Alright guys, we might not have it, so here we go. I'm just gonna pull it up. Do we have it? Let's see. No, we did not. So, let's read this one real quick. Go down to King James Version. This is Isaiah 52.5. Now, therefore... Oh, wait. That's the wrong... Actually, wait. I'm sorry. That is the actually the wrong scripture, guys. Let's go back. Sorry about that. Let's see. Uh, here we go. Here. Bam. First one right there. Okay. So we do have it. Wait. Let me see. Jeremiah 5 2. Let's go ahead and just read that. Uh, hear this now, you foolish and senseless people. Same thing. Let's go down to the uh, King James Version. It says here, hear now this, O foolish people. Without understanding, says that's basically saying the same thing, which have eyes and see not. Uh, I want to point out real quick and real fast that that's what he, he's talking about seeing into the matrix, seeing into past how they mock you daily and you don't even know it uh, because they are wise and you lack knowledge, just like scripture says as well. Uh, so anyways, which have eyes, but see not, or and see not, 
which have ears and hear not. It's a code. If you don't know it, then I don't know. Maybe you're not that close to God. You should look into, you know, reading this book. It'll tell you a whole lot about yourself and where we all came from. All right. So there's that. Let's go ahead and exit out of that. All right. Uh, now that we have seen that, let's go to the devil's device music. Now this is a a inside former insider meaning past tense used to be uh, John Todd. So let's listen. Been around a long time. Was just say they told how when they'd play in their concerts, they would control through witchcraft spells in their mind the people to do different things in the audience. And if they'd work the audience up not with the music, but with their mind and their music combination. Now one of the closest friends that I got during that time that I came, a man named David Crosby, Crosby Still Nation Young. I saw David the day before Christmas last year. I talked with him. I got him away from this witch that he had with him. He told her to go shopping. We were in West Hollywood and I was witnessing around to people that I knew. We went off in this store and we started talking. I said, David, I'd like to ask you a couple questions. I said, I already know the answers, but I've been gone for five years. I'd like to know if certain things are still the way they were when I left. I said, do they, now I'll have to explain some of this when I'm done. Because you're not going to understand it all unless you know something about music. I said, do they still take the master to the temple room? Dave said, yeah. I said, do they still have the coven conjure demons into the master? He said, of course. I said, now i got to know something. What's the main reason for rock music? Lance, you know what the reason is. I said, please, David, I don't want to guess. Tell me what the main reason is. He said, the same as when you were in, so that we can place spells on people that we couldn't cast spells upon. There you go. Let's read about that one. They're all secret. They're all code. The music is meant for spells. Our language is actually, English language is full of spells as well. We already have a video of that. If you want to know about it, go down and look for English witch language. Woe unto them that seek deep to hide their counsel from the Lord, and their works, their works, are in the dark. And they say, Who seeth us? Who knoweth us? Surely, your turning up things upside down shall be esteemed as the potter's clay. For shall the work say of him that made it, he made me not. Or shall the thing framed say of him that framed it, he had no understanding, meaning he didn't know what he was doing. He was unaware of the type of art he was uh Basically, he was being controlled. Again, I say that we're the fallen ones. Uh, he was being controlled by a spirit, host body, via host body. Now, I'm not even going to go into that one yet. Let's go ahead and... read or no let's go ahead and watch this i've got it uh this is ariana grande all properties to her we are using no audio um just the imagery so right off the bat you'll see and we'll break this down right there guys Clothed with the sun. Want me to prove it? I'll prove it to you. And great signs appeared in heaven. She's in the sky just now. You just saw that. Clothed with the sun. With the moon under her feet. And a crown of thorns, stars, 
on her head. Huh. All right. Now let's go to another little point part that I just wanted to point out. This whole song is all about sex, basically how the man, the, the worldly man that doesn't have the mental strength not to give in to a woman sexually and uh, that, that they as women are looked upon as gods to weak men. Hang on. I did not mean to do that. Sorry, guys. We're going to have to deal with that. Golly. Yay. Hopefully that doesn't take too much time because it will not let me skip. Great. Well, I give all kudos to whatever this is. Didn't mean to push that. All right. My point was that is a freaking vagina right here. You see all the layers of paint? That's what it is. All right. Um, bam. There's another vagina right here is the entry hole. I'm just being, you know, right here is the, the lips of it. I'm not using the anyways. And then she, yeah. Okay. Well then there's that. All right, guys. So yeah. Um, okay. Now, actually, let's see, where's the next frame? Okay, there's proving that, you know, she's, she's looked upon as a god. God is a woman. That's the whole point of the thing. Um, right here, uh, it says that God is above all things. The scripture says that God is above all things. And there you go. She's above all things. Um, right in here, she says a lyric, and you can go ahead and pull up the lyrics of the song. Uh, but she says, feel it out. She says something about midnight. I'll say that. She says something about midnight. Uh, that is an elite, I'm telling you right now, that is an elite quote of um, that statement is, is literally an elite quote. You can go and look up the lyrics for a song called Mason by Rick Ross, and he's straight up. He says something about midnight as well. I'm not going to mention all of the lyrics because that is the property of their ownership, not mine. Uh, real quick, this uh, Lucifer is known as the light bearer. Okay, there we go. Now I wanted to point out really quick. Let's go ahead and exit out of some of these because we're just going to go ahead and... Go to my pictures really quick. You just saw that. Okay, so let's go to some photos and let me show you how they hide in plain sight. Really, really quickly because this is a quick video and we only have 15 minutes. You see this right here, guys. Okay, now let me just, what if I did like that or you see what I mean? Okay, now these are called uh, transmutation circles. This this one is actually at my work right here, and it's on the floor. A, a, I work at a music studio. I work with the enemy, if you will. Work with this. I see the people in this industry sometimes. This is a straight-up mockery right here also. I want to point out, this is called the Ong, and that is what she is doing with her hand right here in the video. That is called an Ong. It's all math. It's all coded, guys. They do this in your face all day. Uh, all right, guys, that is going to be it for this one. Uh, we will subscribe to this soon, and we will get a longer period of time. See you guys soon. Leave your comments. Be blessed.